Hey YouTube, Nickel and Diamond here again. I've been working on a project with the door panels where I'm doing reupholstery because I've pulled off the factory door handles and armrests and removed them because I needed a little bit more space. Um, I'm not a huge guy, but I'm about 5'9", about 200 pounds, and it's not really easy for me to fit in with the factory armrests, so I deleted those. The first step to reupholstery is removing the door panels. There's a bunch of clips that are all around. If you've already removed your armrests, you just have one screw left in the cup where the door handle is. Basically just pull the door panel straight off. Um, it's not real difficult. There's clips kind of all around the outside. Then, depending on what you want, um, I wanted a very smooth surface when I was done, so I went ahead and shaved the door pockets. So I got some shots of the back of the door panel and then the front of the door panel. I was able to lay on my new fabric. Um, I separated the upper and lower pieces and had to kind of take some epoxy and rebuild mounting points on uh, upper armrest portion of that door panel. I upholstered the top panel with the same type of technique that I used in my other reupholstery videos using an Alcantara-like sort of stretchy black fabric. Used a little spray adhesive and it worked quite nicely. I was able to get a very smooth result. I used gray faux suede material um, to get kind of that Alcantara-like feel uh, on the lower portions of the door panels and used the gray as uh, color to break up all the black just to give it a little different two-tone. I really think it cleans up the interior line and helps with the overall update of the interior that I'm working on for this project. I also had to widen the speaker holes because the stereo was kind of an afterthought, just like the cup holders and a lot of other things in the Miata. To clearance the speakers and keep them from vibrating against the cutouts, I just removed the factory speaker grill completely, covered it over with the fabric with no additional supports because there's really not anything needed there. You just want to be real careful about clearing out your debris beforehand and you want to use a quality staple gun with really really short staples to actually do the upholstering of things like these door panels and for the later video where I'm doing the consoles. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching and let me know what you guys think of the results.